What's going on, guys? It's your boy, the Adam Westberg Vibes and Young Green. When I tell you I have a video for y'all, when I tell you I have a video for y'all, headphone warning. Um, <laughs> this is something that um, I've been requested on Instagram, Twitter, and Facebook. Um, and actually, once on Tumblr, and like a, I think last year or something, not last year, a couple months ago, uh, yeah, last year, like probably like, I don't know, October, someone gave me the idea or told me I should react to Karen videos. Karens who get what they really deserve. Part 2. Um, now, someone is narrating this, but we are going to sit down and watch this. And, oh my god, huge shout out to Unplugged. Link will be in the description to Unplugged's channel. Uh, let me grab the link here. And it's also going to be featured by... Me, Adam, Westberg Vibes, featured, unplugged, reacting to Karen videos, so he, go subscribe to Unplugged, um, right here, Unplugged, go subscribe to them, check them out, uh, we are about to hop into this video, if you guys do enjoy, hit that like button and hit that post notification bell to be notified, notified, notified. Every time I upload, 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 yeah. Without further ado, without wasting your time, let's get into this mother trucking, fucking, goddamn fucking video with the stupid fucking ass Karens. Let's go. Karens are everywhere. So you best believe we have the greatest videos for you. You better get ready because we definitely have clips of the craziest Karen. In the first video, we found the perfect Karen. Blonde hair, the Karen hairstyle, the Karen clothes, everything. Look, 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 look. It's a, like, level 49 Karen. <laughs> a high level Karen right there. <laughs> look at that hair. It's like super sane. Yeah. She's already a level 49 Karen, and legend has it that if she shuts down one more restaurant, she levels up. In the next video, a Karen randomly bursts open another man's door because she said he was at the wrong side of the road. He was only trying to back up and fix his parking, but Karen was too eager to call the cops on him. You know that you're on the wrong side. Get out of my car. You're on the wrong side of the road. Okay, you're being filmed. Do you know that you're on the wrong. You you're on the wrong side of the road. You're on the wrong side of the road. This is not Europe. You drive on the right side. Get out of my face, please. Get, the cops are coming. Great. Get out of my face. You're on the wrong side of the road. Do you get, know that you're on the wrong side of the road? Do you know that you're on the wrong side of the road? Please back away from Why my car. Why are you on this side of the road? Can you please back away from my car? Why are you on this side of the road? I was backing up. You're going to get a ticket. Okay. For I, driving on the great. Wrong side I was backing out of this space. You're on the wrong side of the road. How do you want You're on the wrong side of the road? Okay, okay. You cannot drive on this side of the road. <laughs> okay. Why, why are you don't, laughing? Don't touch my my. Why are you laughing? The next Karen cuts the wire off a lift for workers who were trying to install something in the neighborhood, and they got it all on camera. <laughs> Three signs you are addicted to stress. Sign one: you can't stop scrolling. And they got it all on camera. This could have caused some serious injuries. She got arrested immediately after that. In the next video, a Karen and Kevin tandem are hysterical because their neighbors are wearing swimsuits while swimming. They're mad that that's all they can see. But who told them to spy on their neighbors in the first place? It's a family home. Oh, it's a family home. Yeah, it is okay. a family home. Yeah. Okay, it's good to know. Yeah, it's a family yeah. home. Okay. But also, what, what, was, a, what was the thing about when there was a swim shorts over there? What was the problem? Do I need to be scaring in underwear? 
Why are you looking at the house, though? Why must? It's why? a better window, man. Am I looking yeah. at the house? I eat dinner right there, staring yeah. at underwear. Look, look at the other house. Yeah. Wrong answer. You're telling okay. me to look somewhere else Listen. when I've lived here longer okay. than you guys? But no, why, now I'm do pissed. I look at your no, house? I'm no, do I look at your house? You know though? what? You guys, you guys never come outside. You do. You never. Well, yeah, listen, when listen, you guys, we, we were going to bed, and my son's outside saying you guys are out there talking, and I told him the same. Shut up. This is this is a private neighborhood. Keep, keep, keep recording it. Yeah, yeah, I will, I am recording it. Because Think you know what? It. Now I'm calling the cops. There's a lot of people you're pissing off. Okay. Trust me. Okay. Trust me. Yeah. Trust me. There's a lot of people no, you're pissing now off. Now you yeah. pissed me off. So I'm so No, I you just wanted to person. ask you about what was going on here. So yeah, after that incident that happened, uh, we ended up calling the cops and reporting them for harassing us and yelling at us. Um, but, well, we can't really do much right now. The next Karen thinks she's all that. She interrupts the music video because she believes they're trespassing. But get this, the actual owner of the property isn't even mad about what the people are doing. wasn't having any of it. Karen and her husband complained that their food took too long to arrive. The McDonald's employee didn't cut Karen some slack and did something totally unexpected. You'll surely laugh out loud. <laughs> Sorry, do you know that we've been waiting like 25 minutes for this food? Huh? We've waited like 25 minutes for this food. What do you want me to do? I don't know, like, like work fast Some enough? free juice or something. Yeah, like give us some it. free food or something. It has to be money I, I'm new employee. No, but like, no, no, but we expect something free, you know, the food for free or something, you know what I mean? Yeah, give us some free food. <laughs> if I think it's a joke, you want this food for free? What do you think this is? A <laughs> charity. Take a food for free. I don't have time, I don't have time. We've been waiting for the food for like 25 minutes. 25 minutes, you I don't know. care. We've been waiting for 10 hours, I don't care. Oh, you don't care? Yeah, we can tell that you don't care. Yeah, well, don't you don't care. care. Do you know what customer yeah, service is? Do you know what, do you, do you know what, what customer service is? Zoom in on his face. What is he doing? You think you want to be playing as me? Wow. McDonald's. UK McDonald's. This is this is where it's gonna happen. What's your bag up? What's your bag up? I don't care. In the next video, we see a different breed of Karen. She's actually scared of viruses, and she kept talking about the six-foot law wherein everybody should be six feet away from each other. So she blocks everyone passing by her. Do you? I don't want to... Where's your mask? I don't... It's irrelevant. It's irrelevant. I don't want to I'm not are. interested in going to the hospital and... Back up. I'm done. Can you please get what you're getting so I can finish grocery shopping? As soon as you back up, might be some good to do some other shopping. Excuse me, sweetheart, but guess what? The size of your grocery cart and where the person who's holding the grocery cart and where you're from standing is six feet. Actually, no, it's exactly seven feet apart. So you are being a complete fucking retarded bitch cumquad motherfucker you stupid entitled fucking karen god damn it go to fucking hell by the time you get back here you'll have plenty of room mm. Mm -mm -mm. i need security i'm gonna need I'm not, but there's a six foot law, and they're trying to get within my six foot range, and I'm not going to let them do it until I'm done I selecting what I want to select. No, I can't, because they get within my six foot when they divide. No, I can't. They can either back up, or they can go do some other shopping and come back when I'm done. This is fucking bullshit. We were literally just trying to go down the aisle. Like I said, there's a six foot law. You 
literally trying to do nothing but make me sick and go to the hospital. I'm fully vaccinated. That makes you feel better. It's irrelevant because it mutated, honey. Don't act like you're stupid. You know exactly what you're doing. store so much. The next Karen is screaming at customer service because she didn't want to wait in line with the rest of the people. And I want help. Okay. Okay. Been with they are a mile long already. Soaking wet. Okay. No compassion. Who cares, right? I can tell I was going to go get yourself. If you were. give me a time. Stop right. Right. Oh, thank you. I can see your face. You know what I'm saying. I said that you did. I'm going to get your stuff. So I'm not going to. After making a scene, she tries to ask for compassion from the other people in the store, which no one gave. And I think if anybody has compassion, you know I've been in the long line already. It's not compassion for people who are yelling at customer service people. We have no compassion for people who are yelling. There's no help over there. Where do you go? We patiently wait in line until we can be helped. Then that's on you. Let's see you do it. I'm not afraid of water. Oh my god. Unacceptable. Why do Karens have to ruin everything good? The next Karen gets what she deserves after wrongfully defending her son. The two of them tried attacking a comedian and booing his jokes. They didn't expect what was coming their way. Yeah, that's true. Oh my oh. god. Now she's getting up on me. Wait, you're his mother, so you're the reason for his atrocious behavior? <laughs> Do I feel good? I feel like an appropriately raised individual because my mom had ethics. <laughs> Man, if only you got this upset with your children and then this stuff. <laughs> video the Karen's kind of sketchy. She's so against her neighbors putting up a fence on their lawn. We wonder why she's so against it. Is she spying on them? You want to be a tough neighbor and I'm going to be tough back. I want them off my lot and you're not putting anything there. The fence thing is being replaced that your husband. You know what? I, I'm, you know what? You created nothing but crap with all your picture taken. We're cutting down, down trees, which actually ultimately helped you. All right. We, we see, took back your property for you because it was creating so many leaves and everything. So what are you taking pictures? I'll call the cops. My husband told me to call the cops. You want me to do that? Yes, and I will show him where the property monuments are. You don't even have, you have no idea where the property line is. Well, you don't know what you're speaking about. You don't yeah. either, because you weren't here when it was put in. You have not, you weren't here when it was put in, okay? Or you weren't old enough to know. Don't even yeah. go there. You don't know what you're saying. You don't saying. even know what you're talking about. You can't be a neighbor and take pictures and make my life difficult when I want to cut down trees and then do this. You're so full of crap. God, you've got me so mad right now. Well, that's what you get for being a neighbor. That's what you get. You get what you get. This is what your you husband... get what you get. No, bitch. Man, I wouldn't have said boo to you, but you want to be a neighbor and sit out here and take pictures and video while we're sitting there trying to cut down trees and all you can do is sit there complain. Your neighbor, your own neighbor has been assigned get out. Does that give you a hint? Do they spray paint on your side of the fence, keep off? Dogs are really man's best friend. 
This Karen is a solicitor trying to sell something to her neighbor when a dog suddenly sniffed her. Of course, she got offended. Who gets offended by dogs? Thank you so much, Taylor. So the cap for this PK is actually 200000 Beagle, beagle. What's safer and cooler than that? This should be about right. These are important for a solid security system. A single zap from one of these bad boys and it's a full-on zombie barbecue. They should be perfect for protecting the house from zombies. I'll surround the whole place with a laser. Hello. 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 Hi, how are you? My name's Veronica. Nice to meet you. Oh, sorry. sorry. That was really rude. Sorry. How did you let him do that to me? No, I, I didn't. I, I'm not, I don't even know who you are, man. No, I'm sorry. See, I'm not the kind of dog, but like... No, you, you're super... I love these kind of dogs, but... It's okay. You know what? It's have a nice Okay, cool. Come on, Z. Good boy. Good boy. That was definitely on something. That was a good she dog. saying nonsense. She's looking for the owner of the house because she claims that she's a tax fraud investigator and she wants to kick them out. Who are you? Investigator from the California State Board of Equalization. Okay, so, so who are you, you looking for? Do you own this property? Are you the owner? <laughs> I'm looking for the owner of the property. Well, then I'm pretty sure if you're the tax fraud investigator for the state of California, that you'll know how to find a property owner. If you're not the tenant on the lease, then I'm going to have the police out here and have you removed in, in two days. You understand? <laughs> you're funny. Are you you're laughing at me? It, will be recorded, so you're it doesn't the matter. Well, it doesn't we'll matter. We'll see what the police say. It doesn't matter. Well, this house looks like it's got issues. You okay. Look like you have issues. And there's pro no. Okay. Oh. Oh, some at your door. You've got squatters here at this property, and I'm going to prove to the police that you don't own it. Okay. You're a squatter. You're on my property. Get off of it. Uh, actually, you know what? I'm going to have you removed from this property in two seconds, and I've got your phone number out here and your son's card. And I'm going to make sure that he's doing no construction without a license. Handle your business. It seems like Karen's always ask for store managers whenever they don't get what they want. This Karen made a scene in the middle of the store, screaming her lungs out for their manager because her card wouldn't work. Y'all, I've never seen a Karen before law. <laughs> She does look like she's 12. Well, maybe at least 15. <laughs> and for the final Karen of the day, it's a Karen who ruins everyone's joy. She doesn't want these people to have a good time during their marathon, so she drives her car in the middle of the street while everyone's running. Run, get out. That was an amazing first episode of Karen's. <laughs> Again, huge shout out to Unplugged. Link will be in the description to their channel to watch more Karen's. 
huge shout out to Unplugged. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye!